I am playing Mike. I am the father of the children in this film, The Strangers, which is about our family, which is uh, in a little bit of turmoil. Cindy, my wife and I have this 15 year old daughter who we're sending off to boarding school because of her problems. Uh, and of course that's causing a lot of disruption amongst the family unit. We spend the night in a trailer park uh, just close to where we'll be delivering our daughter the next morning. And shortly after settling in to our trailer, things start getting a little odd. And, um, and then a bit of horror ensues as we're sort of systematically hunted down by these masked uh, strangers that come sort of out of nowhere, from nowhere, with no identity as they're intent on killing us all. What struck me was just how, how airy the atmosphere was after the first kill where you see there's nothing personal about this at all. It's purely the, the, the stranger's joy of taking another's life and, and witnessing that and, and sort of observing it almost passively, which without sort of menace, without celebration, without uh, you know, any sense of revenge or anything personal about it, uh, which I found you know, horrifying. We never get to know them as characters, we don't understand their reasons why. And I think it's that total ambiguity and, and uh, the unanswered component to the movie that makes it so terrifying. Because um, it's, it's so senseless and, and you realize these characters are just at the mercy of something uh, that they didn't even create. Johannes, what I love about him as a director, he, he's, he knows exactly what he wants and he knows what the scene needs, but he's also loose enough about it that any suggestion of a line or if you want to play the scene a certain way, he's completely open to exploring how that might work. Hey horror fans, stay with me as I've got some facts from horror movies. Now in order to make Samara's walk as creepy as possible in the ring, they filmed her walking backwards and then reversed the shot. Now the skeletons in Poltergeist are not props, they are real human skeletons. And the real life Lorraine Warren makes a cameo in The Conjuring as an audience member while the character Lorraine Warren is speaking. What's your favourite horror movie? Let me know in the comments below and subscribe to our channel and check the notification bell to keep up to date on all the latest releases.